I'd imagine you get a text from your loved one as they're about to go to work and you tell them, I love you. But the next time your phone rings, you get the one call you never expect to actually get. Your husband or wife killed while at work. That's exactly the call Crystal Turner says she got about her husband, Eddie. She says Eddie worked at Seek Automotive in Gastonia. The North Carolina Department of Labor said early Thursday morning an employee there was killed while on the job. WBTV's Anne Marie Haggerty joins us now. Anne Marie, what happened to this man? Alex, the NC Department of Labor said that employee was cleaning a recycling belt when they caught their right arm in the conveyor and it was amputated. That person later died. Tonight, I spoke with the Turner family who say that employee was their beloved husband and father, Eddie Turner. It's like everything you would imagine being a dad. He was, he was a dad to 13 year old Brooke, 16 year old Lindsay and wife to Crystal. And we just celebrated 17 years last month. Crystal Turner says she married Eddie when she was 19, loved his smile, fishing and camping with him and the family they built together. Most of the time he would pick us up at school and we would just have like a simple like conversation, but like they're important. Important words daughter Lindsay wanted to write down and share about her dad. My dad always worked hard to support our family and do anything we needed or wanted, and I love him so much. Crystal said just before going to work, she texted with Eddie, said, I love you. That was the last thing the couple said. We were supposed to grow old together. Crystal says she got word Thursday that Eddie had died. The NC Department of Labor did not identify an employee, but said early Thursday morning, an employee at Sika Automotive in Gastonia died after getting their right arm caught in and amputated by a conveyor. A flag flew at half staff for them today. We know that he loves us and he knows that we love him and that we would do anything to get him, give him back. And to anyone with their family tonight, the Turner family says, Say I love you because you never know when it's going to be the last time. The family was working on making funeral arrangements today just before I spoke with them. The NC Department of Labor's Occupational Safety and Health Division is investigating this event now. Anne-Marie, this is just awful. Terrible situation. Yeah. We have any idea what the timetable will be on this investigation? We know they can take a long time. We're yeah. not sure exactly how long this is going to take, yeah. but it has started. We'll definitely be watching for updates.